Hey guys, it's your girl Lizzie, and welcome back to a brand new video. If this is your first time on my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button right now. And if you're back to watch another video, welcome back to my channel. Okay guys, so you can see in the title, I let TikTok choose my next piercing. So I did one of those filters where it was like, what will your next future piercing be? So you guys probably already know because it says on the title, what the piercing is but here's the clip of me finding out what piercing i was going to do so i'm about to let tiktok choose my next piercing let's do it honestly i was really down for any piercing but this was the the one that popped up so i was like you know what i'm gonna do it i used to have this actually in high school like for a day and then i took it off but i don't know i feel like it's a it's a thing now also if i keep looking down it's because i'm going to like record little TikTok clips while I do this. So I'm kind of new on TikTok, but if you guys want to follow me on TikTok, it's at Lizzie Carrera. I'll pop that up right over here so you guys can follow me on there as well. So just like the other video of where I pierced my nose again, I went back on Amazon. The reason was because I kind of lost all the nose rings that I had in the other piercing kit that I had, as well as it only had 18 and 20 gauge needles. But a septum piercing, they require a 16 gauge. So that's what I ended up doing. I have my package right over here. I'm gonna open it up for you guys so you guys can see how it looks. So let me grab some scissors and I'm going to open this package right up. Just like the other kit, this is how it looks. Almost exactly the same. The only thing is this one has a lot more rings and a lot more needles. It's like a bigger pack. The clamps I'm not going to open only because I already have clamps. There's no point of opening up these ones if I already have ones that are open. So I'm just going to put that to the side right now. Then we got all the needles and all the alcohol wipes right in here and then we got some gloves and then all of our rings like look how thick that is there's a lot of rings in here so all of the needles in here are 16 gauge needles i believe there's about 10 of them so they're all over here i'm gonna take only one then i'm gonna grab some alcohol wipes clean up my nose as well as the needle and the clamp and the rings you know we got to keep everything sanitized and clean so the rings there's a whole bunch of different style rings so there is that one we got these ones over here these huge like these are like belly button piercings i think we got these spiky ones these are the ones i'm going to use and then honestly we just have a lot of different styles so first things first is we got to put on a pair of gloves we don't want to get an infection so i got my gloves on i'm going to clean the rings and the needles and the clamps i got the clamps from the old package that i had which i am going to clean and i'm going to do that right now so the clamps the needle and then we have the ring right over here so I took the ball off of one side of the ring so it can fit inside the needle. So when I pierce it through, it's just going to go right in and then we're going to twist that on. I get so excited, but when I get closer, it's like, what? I'm scared. Also, we need to make sure we disinfect the nose because we don't, again, want to get any infections. I'm going to clamp this on actually i don't even know exactly where i want to put this in like i don't want it to be too high but then i don't want it to be so low so how much of the ring do i want in like this no i don't even know where to mark it i can't even mark the inside of my nose imagine this goes absolutely wrong and i don't like it and i take it off i, I don't know why i'm using the camera to see where i want it when i have a huge mirror right over here so I'm gonna pull this closer so I think the best thing for me to do right now instead of you know messing up is marking where I want it so I'm gonna do that right now okay so I just marked it I can't even see it but I think that's where I want it so I'm going to clamp my nose I don't know why but the clamp hurts more I know it's going to hurt more than the actual needle. Ow, that hurt. This is going to hurt already and I haven't even done anything. Okay. Forget the clamps. I can't do it with the clamps. That's not going to work. 
So I am going to, so I'm going to put it through here. You guys can't see, but here is the needle. Here is the ring. Okay, I'm ready. I'm going to push it in. I don't want to be dumb and pierce my cartilage. <sighs> I'm scared. So one, two, three. Oh. Oh, ew, I felt it. Oh my god, I felt it go through the other way. I can feel it going through, but it feels so weird. It went through, it went through. <sighs> I'm like shaking. Okay, now I'm just gonna push the rest through. Guys, I'm just gonna look at the mirror. I apologize. I'm just trying to make sure the ring doesn't fall off. Okay, it doesn't hurt that bad anymore. The fact that it's like a twist, it's, it's just hurting a little bit too much now. Okay, we got it through. We got it through. <sighs> I look funny. I'm gonna put the ball on right now. Alright guys, so this is how it looks i cleaned around the piercing just so it doesn't get infected but personally guys i don't know if i like it or not i know i just went through all that and i'm not even sure if i'm going to keep it i had it like i said back in high school and i took it out after a day and i don't really think it suits me but that is how it looks it like i don't know it's like i like it but then i don't like it let me just like zoom in for you guys right over here I don't know. I kind of, I kind of, kind of looks weird. <laughs> Maybe because I'm not used to it. But this is how it looks. You guys tell me, does it suit me? I don't know. I'm not really, really a fan of it. So I probably just went through all that for no reason. But I'll keep it for a while. If I don't like it, I'll just take it right off. <laughs> Pain wise, I would give it like a three out of ten. Um, it did hurt when I was trying to get the ring through, but other than that, it didn't really hurt. I, I was just being really dramatic, and then my eyes just got really watery because you know it's my nose. It's sensitive. But this is how it looks. Again, I just got the piercing kit from Amazon. Not telling you guys to do your own piercing. Definitely talk to a professional first before you decide on doing anything. But yeah, guys, let me know in the comments. Does it suit me? Does it not suit me? Again, probably not used to it, so I don't think it really suits me right now. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not subscribed to my channel already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.